laundry trap. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Um, waiting to see the uh, toilet paper test, are we? You'll have to wait to the end for that. This is the boundary trap. And the boundary trap's good. All clear. Nothing wrong there. But what we do have is two block toilets, two separate block toilets. So we've got one lot of block toilet in here. And we've got another block toilet on the end here that have got separate junctions, separate blockages, I believe. So I'll have a quick look with the camera at what's going on. Is that really you? Yeah, it's me. Where have you been? I got my legs fixed after the croc bit them off. Do you like my new legs? Yeah, they're good. Who's that laughing? Cookabar, don't you know that's rude to laugh at someone that's had their legs ripped off by a crocodile? Yeah, sorry about that. It is a bit funny though. I suppose it is a bit funny. At least you got them fixed. Well done, good to have you back, Magpie. Back in the gang. All right, Magpie, let's have a look down here and see what's going on. Block drain. Thanks, Magpie. All right. Okay. So, that looks like the junction. See, there's constant dripping out of there. That looks like the junction for the first problem, which is the toilet in the bathroom. I don't think we can get to that from outside. We'll have to go inside and take out the toilet to clear that. Little bit of rootage there. Little bit more there. Little bit more rootage there. And there's the shaft to the boundary trap. Little bit of a lip there. But that's not causing any problem. Just make sure that that's us there. Yeah, that's us. You can see the camera down there. Now we're going to check with the camera this way. We'll make sure or see what's wrong up there with the other toilet. So we need to flick it that way. All right, so we flicked it up. Let's have a look at what we found. Yeah, we've got big roots already. Mega roots there. I don't know what that is. I hate to speculate. Let's just say corn. So it looks like there's a junction there and there's roots growing in through that junction. Paper coming out of there, so I'd say that's, that's where we wanna go with the camera. And we've got mega roots up there. It's nicely blocked there as well. That'll be servicing the laundry, I'd say. All right, so that all needs to be jetted out. And then we'll do the toilet paper test. But first, I think we'll start on the inside bathroom, pull out the toilet, have a gander with the camera from there, see what we're dealing with, and blast out the roots if there's roots in there. All right. So this is the problem toilet inside. We might just make sure that that's us on that junction before we take out the toilet. We'll put some Ninja Turtle juice in there. Good luck. We'll go and check that. Make sure it's trickling through the right one. It 
even comes out the back there because of the blockage. Yeah, that's us. Ninja Turtle Juice escaping slowly through that pipe that's been bunged in there. All right, we're on the right track. All right, clear this out of here. First things first, turn off the water supply, the stopcock, grab the grizzly, that's for doing the incision, and then cutting through the silicon all the way around the waist of the bowl. Must not slip. This is very sharp. See if that's good enough. Undo the water feed. Done. Mad pie. Good to see you could join us again. You know, uh, do the deeds. We need to flush the excess water in this bowl out. Sure. Count on me. Thank you, mate, boy. Are you kindly, uh, can you get off there? Sure, I'll fly down. Let's see if this comes off easy. Took a couple of tiles with it, but that can't be helped in these situations. They would have been loose anyway. <laughs> tiles missing all around. Ninja turtle juice. There's always one hiding somewhere, isn't there? Mate, right, boy. You want some uh, cockroach? Sure, I'll have a go. Enjoy. Nom, 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 nom. That's it, run. Roots. A little bit of a break. That's where those larger roots are growing in through, through that break there. A bit more of a disjoint there. And then, it goes into a square, into a square junction 
drops down. And across into the line there. Yeah, so we're back to where we started in that line outside. Might just find where that is in case they want to dig it up so we've got straight access into the toilet in the future as opposed to pulling the toilet out every time. That would be better. We'll go locate it. What do you reckon, magpie? Go locate it, get you initiated, get you a pink tail. Yeah, it sounds good to me. All right, let's go. That's what that is. I thought that was a gully that had been covered over, but that's the square. Are you ready? I guess I am. You sure? Yeah, not so sure. All right, maybe we'll just do a circle around you. How's that? Yeah, I think that's all right for now. Nah, let's get a little bit on your tail. That's better. Yeah, I quite like it. Thank you. You're welcome. So, toilet comes out here, drops down there and into there. There are roots in there. We'll cut them from inside, but in the future, if they have problems, it's probably good just to go straight from there. We got the old uh, penetrator. Okay, we're on the roots there. We'll give them a blast. actually come up as opposed to go down where that little place where we did the mark it's gone whoosh straight up there but it's done its job here I cut out the roots bit of a dislocate there we'll pull this back down there we go see if we can drop it around that bend Very square. If we get the jets up to the top, we'll, we'll skin it around. There we go. Now we're going down, servicing that little elbow. left tiny little bit of rootage there on the top corner so I'll just 
position the jet so that the uh, three jets spread out this way so it shoots up to the top there. Here, just for good measure, we might just do the floor wash. Okay, we'll give it a quick squirt down there, just in case there's any roots on that junction there. Very good. Snap the blade. Okay, hook up that water. 
give it a flush, make sure there's no leaks. We'll check for leaks. Yeah, major leaks. Well, that's just great. Pull the toilet out again. Do it again. Release that water. It's leaking from this collar here. Alright, that's all we need. Now we have to go to the shops and get a new one. Let's hope we find one just like this. That'll stop any leaking anyway. All right, we'll put the toilet in last. We'll continue on with what we're doing. All right, Magboy, you ready to go upstream and clear that one? Before we go to the shops and get a, uh, a spare part? Yeah, ready when you are. Let's see how we go. Yes, and I've got to get a spare part. So this is looking upstream. They're the roots. And then when we go up further, you'll see even more of them. This is the secondary blockage. We've just done the toilet inside, um, but then up towards the laundry as well, mega roots. It's completely blocked up there. That's up here. That's up there, yeah. And back here is where the toilet joins in here, just there. But that's all that's all full of roots there, so I'm about to go in and give that a blast. Don't worry mate, you do what you have to do. Don't Thanks worry. mate. This is what's probably been the problem all along. Sometimes the drain rises in there. Yep, Sometimes yep. when you flush the toilet, yep. it fills comes up, up and go goes down. down. No, it doesn't go down. This toilet? Yeah. yeah, yeah. And sometimes I've got to put my hand in there yeah, yeah. and yeah, pull out toilet paper. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know whether someone's chucked a tampon down there. Or I think it's the roots. It's the roots. It's the roots. It's the roots. Look, all of this, we like to blame the ladies. Yeah. <laughs> all of this is coming off the walls like that, and yeah. everything's cracking the foundation. Everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The I whole reckon street. it's. I reckon it's the fig tree. Yeah. Well, they pulled one out and they pulled out what the other tree behind it. Yeah. They pulled one out. It was like 33 feet tall. Oh, really? You know what I mean? And they, yeah, the yeah. government said. These people said we'll pay for it, we just want to yeah, get yeah. rid of it because yeah. it blocks everything out that way. Yeah, yeah. But it was massive. Yeah. And they came, they chopped it up and took it out. Nice and life. then this started happening. Yeah, yeah. So I have a feeling they've pulled the roots and blocked it. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? But yeah. it's got to get done anyway, you know. Not a problem. Look how much leaves fall here. I mean, what do you expect? Yeah. 
top I'll get that little bit because yeah, I need right. to get a new flush uh, thing in me bob for the back of the pan. No worries, man. And uh, just when you go, and just, we're just done. Push the gate shut. Yep. So you don't have to pack up or anything. If yeah, you yeah. Like, we'll do. Here, so no yeah, yeah. Come in. Nice one. All right, mate. Thank I got you. The day off because it was raining. Oh yeah. No rain. <laughs> it's coming. And the other it's day, coming. And the other day he calls me to work. And yeah. He was pissing down and we worked all day. <laughs> Murphy's law. Oh, mad, yeah. <laughs> Just wanted to make sure it's clear. I wonder what that is. Oh, that looks like broken pipe up there. That's up towards the laundry. That might be the cap. Cap's all broken up there. Busted. Looking a lot better. That doesn't look real good up there though. I think that's just the cap there, that's the end of the line, so hopefully that's not going to cause too much of a problem. What we probably want to do is jet up there though. I think that goes up to the laundry gully. And we want to get up in there because that's the that's the toilet and it's got roots as you can see up on the toilet junction so we've got to flick up inside there Let's try and flick in there. We just got to continue on until all those roots are out of there. We'll just make sure that that's our line to the toilet. Just try a different head quickly. We'll do it through to the side. 
they should clear up those bits of roots there. Yeah, we cleaned them up and we've actually gone up the line as well. Tiny little bit there, I think they're all loose bits. Yep, they're all loose bits. We'll pull our head out and we'll head up. I'll just clean that little bit there. Yes. Yes. I told my mum just now, can tree roots from the front to the back chockers. Yes. She said, no worries, do it. I'm just, I just feel bad for you, mate. Look at these No, boots. no, don't worry about me. You and number I'm one. I'm loving it. No, no, I'm all good. I just but don't want your equipment to get rid I'll, um, I'll grab a jacket if it gets too heavy. Cool. I can open the garage. The garage has got nothing in it. You can... If, you, if you're worried about anything getting damaged or wet. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, it's all good. I've got an umbrella I can put here. Have you? You want an umbrella? Yeah, if you've got an umbrella, that'll be good, thanks, mate. Very kind of him, isn't it? Magpie, yes, he's a gentleman. All right, now what we want to do is we want to go up to this plug, this broken plug at the end. and jet up the side there. Can I just give you a look quickly? It's nothing to be alarmed about, yeah. but if you go up to the very end, yeah. look look at that, that's all. It looks like it's probably an old cap where the roots have, have busted through the cap and it's all busted up there. I don't think it's anything to worry about, but just before there, it looks like it's the, um, the inlet for the for the gully yeah. now at this stage I don't think there's anything you, you have to really do anything about that because it's not gonna affect you unless it keeps on pouring in and then comes downstream then then it's gonna cause a problem just keep an eye on it yeah, yeah. keep an eye on it I'll um I'll locate where it is for you anyway from, yeah. now that that's gone it might be better it was, it was Three foot tall. Uh, right in the corner against the fence over here. Oh yeah. Where the where this where this pipe is, and they're yep. worried about that pipe. Oh, okay. So they come and cut it out of here. Yep. You see, you've got a second one here. Mhm. Mm right. But the thing is, look what's on it. These bloody things, I reckon that's what it's done. It's called these crawly things get into the. Oh yeah. Things. Yeah yeah. You know, even the fence started falling down. I had to tie it up. Yeah right. Next is the roofer. Yep, never ending. It's right there somewhere. Yeah. There might be this corner here. I had problems here. I had to put my hands in there. Okay. To get out the leaves. Yep, yep. That seems to be where we are. I'll, un I'll unblock all that. Anyway. Yeah. You know what it is? It's probably a. That's where it drains out, but that's what I did. That's why I put this white mesh in. Oh, okay. But yeah. before then, it always used to drop down that freaking hole, so. In the corner. Up here. What's that one? This is just the laundry. Isn't oh, that's the, the laundry. Yeah, it's just got a sink here. Can you just run that sink for me, please, mate? Yeah. I'll just see if the water comes out of there. There's some water coming out of here now. Okay. Yeah, that's good. That's us coming out of there. I'll give it a blast in there, clear those roots. And we're good. How are we looking? 
Oh well, looking much better. We got the head up there. Pull it back out. There we go. Hey, yeah. Oh, another one. Oh, good man. Thank you. Yep. That's... Okay. Well, that looks very good. Well, that's all the roots cut out. We'll do a toilet paper test. Toilet paper. Lots of toilet paper. Give it a flush. You do the honors, magpie. All right, turn the honors. Hit it with your beak. Come on, be a bit stronger than that. All right, magpie, I think it beat us. Uh, you know what it is? Those roots have come down here and they've blocked up the, uh, the boundary trap. We have to give that a bit of a blast before we can do the, uh, the paper test. Okay. Oh yeah, look at all of them. Yeah. See all those roots down the bottom? They're all the roots we've cleared from upstream. So now we need to clear them out here. That's picture perfect, guys. Not the bad weather's moving in. Now we can do the toilet paper test, right, boy? Because the boundary trap's clear. Mate, can you do me a favour please? Can you flush that toilet yeah. with a whole heap of paper? And I'll, I'll go down the other end. Just give us about two seconds, no three way. seconds. Alright mate, 
Wi-Fi, this is the time to shine. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. All right, ready when you are. All right, mate, boy. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. Go. Thanks mate, very good. good. Um I'm just gonna pack up. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the I'm gonna go to the shops. I'll grab another one of these. What's that? That's at the back of the pan. This oh. is perished. That's split. And this needs a rubber. That didn't have a rubber. Do whatever you gotta Lock drain. All right. She's busy. You got one of these thing in me bobbies mate it's all good, all good thank, thank you, you. Recyclable. Still here, haven't run away. Good to see. Keep up the good work, guys. Cookaburra. See that slides on. That tall, eh? Yes. So this new 
this new power that we put at the back will help stop the leaking. Most of these places are really hard to, you know, like even the new places after six months it starts happening. Yeah. I said, my mum goes and puts some white potatoes in the backyard. I said, what are you doing? I said, then you know, that, you know, when it rains, it'll go into the grass. Well, her place, can't say nothing. That's it. Mum's boss. Before I sell the canut, I'm just going to check to see if there's any leaks because otherwise we're going to go through the whole process again and again. I tried the, the hose there, I wrapped the tissue around it so the hose isn't leaking anymore. Oh yeah. They're alright. Yeah, no, there's no leak here, this is alright. Yeah. You need to just fix it. Okay, turn on the water back on. It's, it's a really deceiving one too because you don't see it where it's leaking from. I think it's really slow. Yeah, I think now that we've got the new um, seal, seal yeah. you're going to be all right. And that smells the roots, aren't they? Rotten roots. Yep, that's rotten roots. Because you can smell it up always in here in the bathroom, you can smell it now. It's not easier to make it perfect than you can't. Yes. You got to tell Frustrating. Them, yeah, you've got to tell them alternate ways and you try to explain to them why you can't and they just don't want to take it on board, man. They just don't believe you. So in these cases, I do it and I say to them straight out, I'll be, be seeing you again. Yeah. <laughs> Three weeks later, they're ringing me. Yep. I suppose around the east here you get a lot of these tight corners and oh, yeah. small flats where you've got to go up the stairs, you can't get your tools around the corners. <laughs> so you go to work man the day's cost you instead of making money. That's it, going backwards. I got one last week, $238. Really? Because I parked half on the gutter and half on the street, I said listen it's Bell Main. There's no room in the lane. The, the garbage truck can't get past. Yeah. I'm only five minutes to throw the bags in on green waste, then I'll get off. No. Sweet. Unbelievable. Then gave you a ticket. Yeah. $238 and two points. Really? No mercy. Parking on the footpath, endangering public pathway. Just doing your job. Yeah. And I said, thanks, mate. I said, it's all right for the bushes to hit people in the head and the branches. I said, that's not dangerous. And I said, no, everything's dirty. Mm. I said, but you want to book me because I spent the three minutes near the garbages mm. to pick up rubbish. Mm. Oh, it's the law. Sweet. <laughs> I said, yeah, I know. You punish the people that work. The ones that do nothing and get $1,280 on the couch every two weeks. <laughs> so you bow down to them. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I've been working since I'm 13, I'm 52, I'm still working here, mate. All I've been doing is paying taxes. I don't have to go to the toilet in the middle of the night anymore in my socks and come back to the wet socks. It sucks. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you're half asleep, yes. you get back to the bed and you go, what the? <laughs> Alright, oh, sorry, what was your name again? Ollie. Ollie? Ollie. Yeah. Ollie? Ollie. <laughs> yeah, I don't meet very many Ollies. Ollie, obviously this is, um, yeah, this is all wet. Wait 24 hours. 100%. I put a, a sign on it. Uh-huh. On a pop phone. Okay. Otherwise he's going to bust open. Yeah. At first, my mum thought I was going crazy. Mm -hmm. It happened for a week. I'd come in here at one o'clock in the morning, go to the door to do the wee with my eyes shut, and I'd sit down and get up and my foot's wet. In the morning, I tell my mum, listen, something's leaking in there. 
Yeah. She goes, oh, I could be coming up from the... I said, no, it wouldn't be coming up that high from the drain. I said, is the toilet leaking? She didn't believe me until one night she did it herself. And, yeah, yeah. And, and she thought, well, why is there water here? She goes, why is it coming up from the drain? I said, it's not coming up from the drain. It's coming from, coming from the back of the pan. Yeah, you weren't going crazy, Ollie. I thought, oh, in the end, they nearly convinced me because yeah, everyone yeah. was saying, it's, no, 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 no. no. Well, it, what was happening is it was backing up from those roots, then it was coming out the back of the pan and dribbling through to here. Well, well the water goes the, the least way of resistance yeah. anyway. Yeah, yeah. Ollie, I'm going to put this uh, this paper in the toilet. Don't flush it. If you can do the honours for me and flush, please. Okay. All right. Ollie's going to flush. On the count of three, magpie. One, two, three. Beautiful. Where's that paper? Come on. Where are you, paper? One more time for good luck. See that paper for sure. Oh. Ollie, yeah. can you do it one more time with paper again, please, mate? It filled up, right up, the toilet filled up. Oh, okay. Slowly, slowly, I must have put too much paper. Slowly, slowly. Yeah, so I, I did a paper blockage, sorry. Do you want to put toilet paper? Yeah, put toilet paper, not too much. Um, and then we'll flush again. Okay. Yep. Here you go. The old too much toilet paper blocked up the pan. That was my fault. I actually blocked the toilet. Looks like I need to plunge my own blockage now. Still doing it? Yeah, mate, really slow, even the, uh, paper on top. Okay. Yeah, I put too much paper in there. Long toilet. She's filling up and she's slowly going yeah. down. Yeah, that was my fault. I put a big, big, yeah, I know, you big blob. Right. You don't usually use too much to wipe your bum. No. Yeah. Because if you put too much, it'll bog anything. 100%. At least you've got one of those when sucking things. You try using the plunger <laughs> on these new toilets. You oh, can't no. get the suction on it. Yeah. Ten times lucky. Okay. Beautiful. On the count of three. One, two, three. Beautiful. Very good. Yes, thank you, Ollie. Mate, I swear, I've never met another person on. <laughs> in my whole 52 years, I used No to way. I'm the first Ollie? Yeah. There you go. All good. All good, Magpie. All good. Yeah, I've got something special for you, Magpie, for returning to the nest. Nutella, my favourite. All good? All good. All good. All good, Ollie? All good? Yeah. All good, Kookaburra? All good. <laughs>